Well, just made it to Lambertville from uh, Columbus. It is definitely a warm day. We got probably, uh, it's gonna hit 90. Not, no big breeze. I did bring a few of the dolls from uh, the house. Uh, thought this uh, quilted teddy bear with the celluloid buttons or, I mean, he needs a little repair with his leg. Good Santa box. Got the, picked that up yard sale and this came from the farmhouse. But these all came from the farmhouse. So definitely a uh, it's actually a lock of uh, human hair. But this is our setup today. The football cards from the yard sale. Like this uh, toolbox here. I guess it was a sherry crate of some sort. Like. But a little, a little bit. We'll go for a quick walk, see if we can find anything, and see uh, see if we can get rid of some of this stuff. What's up, Jim? You find anything good? No, but thing we bought at the yard sale. So many. I mean, when you hear that, yeah. don't you have a little great so, hmm? It's the in Indian, I guess. No, you don't. You figure it out. Well, little bit. To find yeah, out. it's normally 800, right? Could be. I have Indian from 60% up to 95%. 95? Usually it's lower. Yeah, this, this stuff doesn't have any uh, odor, so... Put acid on it, and if it gets dark, it's a little gate. If it's good, they're not too dark. It's yeah, it was right there. With me? Yeah, it's 800. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah. It is 800. So it turned black if it was like 60%? Yeah. Even, even now, you see it's a little dark there? Yeah. That means it's 8. If it's 60, it's going to be a real black. Then mm -hmm. I don't know exactly how much I'm going to have to assay it. I don't know. It was, it was one of end of the day yard sale pick. I think it was the last thing I, I bought. Yeah. What is 800 uh, 1950. Okay. So 1950. It's good. It's more than I spent at the yard sale. <laughs> I think I spent 20 there. So it was, it was a wind. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. 20 on, uh, on them. I think I have something. They'll, they'll clean up. And I, when I was a small, I tried to do something and the call, and then I play all my life with Paul. <laughs> I think, she, yeah, she has green eyes. I don't know what color her, her it's eyes are. Dot, and it's dirty eyes. <laughs> yeah, they, they'll clean up their glass. I think I was at a booth last week. Somebody was selling the eyes for 25 bucks. Yeah. Eyes? Yeah. Just the eyes. Yeah, on these dolls because they're so big. Kitty records. Two bucks on all the kitty records if you could use them. Some people like the colored ones. How much is the little one? Uh, I'll do 10. Okay. So 20 for the pair, 15 for the bottom one by itself. It'll clean up. It just. I mean, what are you talking about? Yeah, I'll do both for 20. All right, I got a bag. Oh, thank you. What do you think if I do work here? It will be work for us. Uh, it should, honestly, I, I might have a, a little wet rag. They'll, it'll just clean right off. There you go. Thank you very no much. Problem. Thank you. And you need to wash your clothes, but yeah, that the cl the cloudy will wash everything. yeah the cloudy will come right off. I like her little uh, I didn't see that the little bear pendant. I like 
leg this size? So it, it's hard to find the bigger ones. What do you think? What time is it? It's like fifties. How much? Yeah, uh, sixties okay. probably. Uh, uh, sixty bucks on the square one. I can do. Uh, if I will take all three, how much it can be? Forty-five on all three is the best. Fifteen dollar discount. Making it so I can fit everything in the truck. <laughs> I always like when I can shut the shut the zipper. Feels like I sold something. Cool, popular signs. Uh. In my case, I will lose forty. About forty-two. That way, I get iced tea out of the deal from the restaurant. I will. Okay. Alright, thank you very much. Alright, I have three. Can I have three bucks? I don't know what we could use this brush for, but it's really nice. I mean, I guess it's for the leather. Here you go. Thank you. I don't know what they will do with it. Scare your neighbors. <laughs> uh, maybe you have something. Yeah, I can help you wrap it. Yep. Yeah, I'll go get you one. Okay, I will be back. I will take this clothes. All right, thank you. Put in the car and then I'll be back. Okay. okay. Thank you. Well, take a quick look around. Some little rabbit. How much is the rabbit? Uh, Forty bucks for you. Very yeah, nice. It's, Zol it's Zolna, you know. Yeah. Yeah, it's a cool one. I have to show uh, Lindsay yeah, see yeah, if yeah, she wants it. it. Yeah, yeah. Take it over there. Oh. Right. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah, yeah. It's very cool. She said it didn't really go, so cool. it, no I liked it though. Yeah, Thank you. Cool. You gonna go up to Greenfield in uh, July? Uh, once they let. Once they start doing the international travel, I'll be at Brimfield. Yeah, yeah. Just because that's... That's I, where you I, get most of your... I, it feels like that's where a lot of it sells. Yeah, me too. I think maybe in September. I'll that, that's what I'm hoping. Yeah. So, as everybody gets vaccinated. Yeah. I mean, our, our, vaccine rate street, uh, our vaccination rate here is like 75% right really now in, in like, Jersey. Like Europe, it's like 10%. Well, it's... We have to release... Or they have to release more. Yeah. All right. Let's see if we find anything else. Those three, I guess. Okay. Almond oil. You guys have a lot of nice old stuff. Yeah, thanks. Yeah, I've seen that out of. Oh, okay. You have one more load, or is this everything? What do you get on the stand, by the way? It's missing all the bottles. Yeah, if you give me five bucks, you got it. I remember when we put that. I had the bottles. Yeah. All right, thank you. Story of airship, sounds pretty cool. Uh, too bad it's got that stain. Lots of neat Zeppelin pictures though. be a fun book to decoupage. Ended up, uh, he offered me that uh, piece of silver plate for four, so ended up getting that. I guess I had a top, but it is pretty. Come, come, come over to us now. Please, I'm right here in the first row. How you doing, Dave? Pretty good. Good morning. Good morning. What was this for? Come to the furnace old, or? old trolley tags. Pretty cool. Yeah, thanks, man. What do they sell for? And 400. They're awesome. Yeah. Okay, I'll talk to you in a little bit. Where at? Uh, NP. So, what I'm thinking, I see, N I'm thinking. It's T P N. Mm hmm. Pennsylvania, so, uh, 
Pennsylvania, maybe. Northeastern Pennsylvania Transit. Yeah, maybe. It's cool. Are we turning into Philadelphia? Yeah, it could be Philly. <laughs> it could be. Almost probably Philly. 500 for both of them or 500 a piece? Uh, no, a pair. A pair. I'll, uh, I'll send Benny a picture just because that's, this he one? might, okay. if it is Philly, he'll, he'll buy it just because it's Philly. Okay. So, it's okay to take a picture, right? Yeah, I, yeah, that's I cool. like how it has the hand paint around the edge. Did you see that on this one? No, I didn't. The, the see it? Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Well, it takes you to pick out everything. Well, <laughs> they, these are cool. Thanks, Dad. Appreciate it, bud. All right, I'll, I'll, I'll send him a picture. Good morning. That's pretty cool. What do you get on the old wing nuts? Uh, 10 bucks a piece. They're fun. I don't think I've ever seen them dovetailed like that or blacksmith made. Yeah, actually, you can look them up online. Just type in blacksmith made wing, wing nuts. nuts. Yeah. And just like like a bolt and a wing nut uh -huh. goes for like 60 bucks. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Learn I'm something that for 20. Yeah, learn something different every day. Yeah. I mean, if you want them all, I can make a deal on all of them. Definitely cool. Probably from like an old carriage or something. What what year? I have no clue. 1850s. I would say 1800s. Yeah, yeah 1850s is my guess. It's awesome. I just thought they were cool as shit. <laughs> thank, thank you for showing me. Sure. What are you doing? Pretty good. I ended up buying a whole load for I think 120 <laughs> to fill up the. That's we're gonna right. we're, we're gonna leave with more Everything stuff than we sold, came. Yeah. It's already filling up again. Exactly. God, she was probably disappointed. I can see that on it. She almost had an empty truck. We could have went someplace. But look at this, Lindsay. I got this for... Oh, cool scrapbook. Yeah, yeah. Cool. it's a big one, too. We'll have to go through that when we get home. All right. So we're, we're packing up. Lindsay always hates when I say, I can't believe this didn't sell, but I really can't believe this didn't sell. I know it needed a little bit of love. One of my... Uh, Picks that would have been the first thing to sell today. So you'll have to go high since I bought all that stuff. Definitely a, definitely a nice day at the flea market. Our neighbor had already packed up. No luck on selling the bowls? No. We, we swore somebody would have asked about them. Did anybody ask about them today? I think we brought them three times, the enamel dishes, and nobody's asked. So, is what it is. We have to put some potting soil in the one and we'll plant our hens and chicks. Yeah. I'm trying to wait to put on the stuff I just bought on all this other stuff first so definitely uh some razor blades Ended up not having that too much more than what we started with after buying that load. So let's we'll see if we can find a couple more things and then I'm going to get out of here. Go walk that other side. Bye. Thank you. All right. Oh, so much cooler under here. I think I have to start getting a booth here on uh, Sunday underneath. Stay out of the sun. fish. How's he selling it, do you know? A, a dollar. A dollar a piece.
else we find? Oh, sorry. Pretty good. Good morning. <laughs> Should we sell you something? Well, oh well. I, she does do a better job than me. Ten bucks for the flag holder. This is an old hook. Oh. I like how he has his poof, everything. Five bucks each on all the old hooks. Victorian hardware. Definitely nice and organized. The ends for old hand irons. This is a good buy for five bucks. The double, uh, he's got a pair of them too. I think we'll get that. Definitely, uh, East Lake Victorian. I had a couple others for those. Hold the lantern. The swing arms. Some brass keys. Yeah, I think I'll get the pair of those though. Definitely. I mean, they're old, they've just been repainted. Definitely, uh, definitely a lot of stuff here. Did you make all the egrets? Look great. Out of PVC. Good idea. All right, see if we find anything else. Think they're real? Yeah. <laughs> Picasso's? Yeah, I did it last night. I was looking at something that Google sent me with uh, Bob Ross and how many paintings he painted. Oh my God. <laughs> I think second was Picasso though. He had like uh, I'm sorry. three to 5,000, but Bob Ross had like 30,000. Really? Yeah. And I, believe it or not, his his artwork, Bob Ross, what do you think it sells for? I couldn't believe that for out, because he used to paint it in like a, a minute or two. Uh, they, they said like 10 grand each. Really? I was, but I mean, I guess he sold most of it out of Alaska. Yeah, I think my wife had more. Uh, with this one, I saw a mark. Yeah, I could do better with it. Hey, you did have one more of the fish. Yeah. Oh, you know what? I found that. Take it. I forgot to tell you. You can have it. It's a, it, this is a sturgeon. <laughs> put it with the other fish. Oh, thank you. Well, made it back. Figured uh, had to go through the scrapbook. Bought a few other things at the flea market, but nothing as good as the scrapbook, I don't think. Looks like there's hundreds of pages. I'm gonna skim through them real fast and we'll see uh, see if there's anything like the frog and the kid underneath the umbrella. Definitely looks like it's 1890s, maybe a little bit older maybe 1880s. These were very popular being made back then. Um, that Washington Cross in Delaware is pretty cool. I'm hoping there'll be some Santas or something in here too. The kitten's really fun. Look at this one. The horse. Some great advertising in here. 
these are all good the I guess that's for canned beef or corned beef corned beef I don't know if you can hear the locusts I just have a few here but some places can't hear anything Wow, look at all these old soup labels, or I mean can labels. Blueberries. Pretty sure these all went on the side of cans. Heavy in syrup, that's my guess. I like the cats. The cat in the fishbowl is pretty fun too. With this being so big, it's about 30 inches. We could actually get some really large uh, pieces in here. There's a Santa Claus, the Easter Bunny. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Or maybe it's just Santa bringing presents. That's a toy. And that's the first Santa. These are all different advertising dry goods. I wonder if they'll have uh, all the holidays though. The nights are pretty great. Look how big they are. First blank page. I like the frog s smoking a little pipe. Oh, some more uh, more can labels. Awesome. I love the, how bright the tomatoes are. I might have to put this in my own collection of books to keep. Look at this lobster. Uh, I still have that jewelry making book uh, with all the jewelry designs from uh, Brimfield. The baseball players are pretty cool. I like the frogs also. It is amazing what. Uh, is out there. Definitely uh, sold the, this is a big lunar moth. Had a decent day for, uh, I guess this is A, B, or C. No, I guess it's not the alphabet. But we had a decent day for a Sunday selling stuff. Just a great book, though. There's a little... No, oh, it's just a fake stamp. If those were real, they would be actually worth some money. Another lobster, starting to get hungry. <laughs> no big holiday uh, pages yet though. We're about halfway through, maybe a little less. This is definitely one of the biggest scrapbooks I, I've ever got. My buddy found it at a yard sale. Uh, yesterday and he said uh, it was the lady's grandmother's that's a pretty great one. little bather 
or swimmer. You can barely hear the birds today over the locusts. Like the ducks. The cats are great. 1883 is the copyright on that one. This is 1882. The first two with dates that I saw. 1878. So yeah, it's got to have been done in the 1880s. One more empty page. But oh, this is all beach. Look at all the sandpipers. Ship's pretty cool. This is actually an ink blot, kind of, kind of real thick. So is the cat. I've actually seen the cat before. A little captive. There were a couple other. What's this one? Uh, it's just some flowers underneath. I like the man on the moon. I think the best thing are all these labels. Just great. Look at the strawberries. Cigarette cards. Eagle's pretty cool. She's great with the sunflower headdress. A lot of New York uh, city advertising. Broadway, New York. I guess these are all presidents, maybe. Or leaders of yeah, Spain. That might be it. Oh, nope. We're still. That's the first double page of empties. Little kid fishing. I like how the rabbit's chasing the hunter. <laughs> oh, wow. Look at all the. Old leaves. The strawberries are cool. They're actually pressed. Well, hopefully you found this end part interesting. Definitely was uh, definitely was cool that they had this many uh, saved. 
most of the back of the book is empty. There wasn't really any uh, any holiday, but it is fairly early for a bunch of the holiday stuff. This one's pretty, pretty cool. I'm not sure when they started marketing Christmas. I know uh, by 1909 it was in full swing, but it's harder to find this stuff from uh, the early 18 or er, late 1800s. She's pretty fun. All right, I guess that's everything. Hopefully, uh, hopefully you thought it was an interesting video for the year 1900. Pretty fun calendar. All right, see you later. Thank you again for watching. If you haven't yet, give somebody a call, might be alone, and we'll see you next video. Peace. Sorry about the cicadas. This was fun though. I hope the kids find it as interesting as I did. Can't wait to show Gabby.